Welcome to Train Talk TV, episode number three. Summer's underway and scenic and attraction railroads are getting up to full steam. We've got some new ways for the younger and the older to get their train fix. Ambassador steam engines are visiting local communities across North America. And we're taking my mom for a train ride on the Rocky Mountain near Whistler Sea to Sky Climb. Ah, summer, the season of dusty model railroad layouts as people go outdoors to visit their local railroad attractions and tourist attractions they run into on their holidays. Heritage Park is Calgary's tourist railroad attraction. The park takes you back to the early 1900s. For railroaders, that means steam runs every day. You can take a trolley from the main gates to the parking lot and you can tour a roundhouse full of vintage rolling stock. Most theme parks are open daily during the summer, but do check their websites for local hours and times. For the younger crowd, how about summer camp at a railway museum? The Southeastern Railway Museum in Duluth, Georgia is holding a summer camp for children aged 4 to 10. The camp runs from 9 to 10 when kids learn about railroad jobs, do railroad crafts and railroad themed activities. They also of course get a train ride, but they get to go on the caboose. For the retirement crowd, in Newville, Pennsylvania, some seniors are staying busy working on the model railroad. Retirees at the Green Ridge Village build and maintain 2,000 feet of HO scale track on their layout modeling the old Cumberland Valley Railroad. For some elderly train fans, the model railroad has sealed the deal when looking for a retirement home. Following a tradition going back to 1908, UP's legendary number 844 steam engine will pull a special train for Cheyenne Frontier Days. The Denver Post Frontier Days Special will make a round trip between Denver and Cheyenne on July 24th. The train will also be on display various times during the event. What's cool about this is you can follow the train via regular tweets on Twitter or by GPS, and the link's in the show notes. CP's Community Rail Tour kicked off in Calgary, Alberta on Canada Day with a stop in Banff, Alberta the next day. The Last Spike Community Tour is the first planned set of excursions for CP's 2816 steam engine in over 18 months. The actual Last Spike is being carried on board on a special museum car and will visit communities in Alberta and British Columbia over the summer. Proceeds from excursion fares go to charity. See the show notes for links to a schedule and details. Well, I'm off to ride the Rocky Mountaineers Whistler Sea to Sky Climb with my mother on a special trip. We'll have some footage in the next episode. This episode is sponsored by Cribscapes Collectible Cribbage Boards, unique, personalizable gifts available at www.cribscapes.com. Thanks for watching. Bye. Welcome to Train Talk, episode number three. I'll do that again. <laughs>